Hi everyone. After many requests from parents to solve a subtraction problem using what's called a place value chart, I decided I was going to go ahead and make this my next video. So if you see um, that those words, place value chart, it should trigger this video for you. So first and foremost, we are going to solve this subtraction problem the way that you and I know how to solve it. So we have 134 minus 52. 4 minus 2 gives us 2. 3 minus 5 we can't do, so we're going to go ahead and borrow from the 1. Make it this 13 minus 5, which gives us our answer of 82. Now we're going to go ahead and solve it using the place value chart. So I've already went ahead, took the liberty and went ahead and, and made the chart for us. We have the hundreds place, the tens place, and the ones place. Now we know in 134 there's only one, a one in the hundreds place. There is a three in the tens place, so we're going to make three dots. And there's a four in the ones place, so we're going to make four dots. Now we're going to subtract 52 from this chart. Now, there's a two in the ones place, so we can go ahead and mark out two of those dots, and a five in the tens place, but we don't have five dots. So what we have to do is we have to borrow from the hundreds place, and we have to then make 10 dots over here. Now we have enough to borrow from, so we're gonna go ahead and take those five away, and that leaves us with eight in this column and two in this column, giving us that 82 that we got earlier. Now, I was taught or shown this way in school when I went to school because it helps us to see what's, what's being done when we subtract. But never was I sent home multiple subtraction problems to solve this way. And why is that, parents? I wore this shirt for a reason. Because listen, Ain't nobody got time for that. Right, parents? 